Welcome to this look at the upcoming Farming Simulator League, what we know so far, plus an exciting channel announcement from me, Mr. Sealy P. So, up first, um, introducing the Farming Simulator League. Now, this was first posted February the 6th. There's going to be a little bit of reading to start off with. I'm going to go through, because there are a lot of people that don't know anything about this, don't know some things about this, don't know what's been released, what hasn't. So, I'm going to go through all of that and we'll do the announcement towards the end. So, after testing the waters in 2018 with the first season of the Farming Simulator Championship with the bales stacking 20 bales onto a trailer, fastest time possible, uh, Giant Software is ready to dive deeper into the world of esports with the upcoming Season 2. Major changes lie ahead when the Farming Simulator Championship becomes the Farming Simulator League, a full-fledged esports league uh, with 10 tournaments across Europe. That is now up to 14, I believe. At the end of the season, the best teams will compete for the title of the Farming Simulator Champion and €100,000 in prizes. Every single tournament will not only grant circuit points for the best teams, but also wield big prizes, bringing the total prize pool for Season 2 up to a total of €250,000. Giant Software teamed up with some of the industry's finest for the upcoming league, partnering with Logitech G, Intel, Noble Chairs, as well as long-term partner Nitrado, to provide the best experience possible to both players and fans of the Farming Simulator League. I apologise if I mispronounce any of the names, companies, those kind of things. I'll try to avoid it. We have a unique opportunity, explains Christian Arman, CEO of Giant Software and manager of the eSports division. Competitive farming is something people have enjoyed for years now, but it hasn't been done in eSports so far. We have lots of esports enthusiasts in our company who can't wait to show the world that farming can indeed be fun and competitive at the same time. We believe we found the right mix of real farming and fun to play game elements to ensure everyone will find it entertaining. The game itself is changing as well. Not only will the new league be held in the brand new Farming Simulator 19, but it will also move from bale stack into a competitive 3 vs 3 mode, where teams challenge each other to determine who is the best on the field. The game will of course stand true to its roots in farming and combine real field work like harvesting with fun and challenging game elements. Giant Software will reveal more about the new game mode in the near future. That was the 6th. Um, if we then go forward to February the 7th, um, Giant Software and Logitech G announced their partnership. Well, that's kind of been already said before, but um, Giant Software, creator of the well-known farming simulator series, and Logitech G, the iconic gaming brand of Logitech, are excited to announce the two companies are collaborating to enhance the farming simulator experience in 2019. In essence, what that's about is Logitech G um, bringing out various different um, bits of kit and equipment to customise the whole kind of gameplay. Um, we believe that 2019 is going to be an important year for farming sim gaming, says Vincent Burrell, General Manager of Gaming Simulation at Logitech G. By combining Giants Farming Simulator 19 with our unique heavy equipment gear, players will get the ultimate sim experience. We're excited to work together to bring gamers a realistic, immersive experience. Uh, so right at the very bottom it says we are very proud to have found a partner that shares our vision of the future of farming, uh, farming, sim farming in Logitech G, explains Christian Arman, CEO of Giant Software. Logitech G is known world worldwide for its high quality hardware, which our players already love. We are very excited to see where this takes farm sim in the future. Um, so this companies are coming on board. It's, it's, it's picking up pace. That was as of February. Also February the 7th, Bednar FMT joins the Farming Simulator League. And this is how serious this is now being taken. Esports generally across the board, a lot of the esports tournaments and championships and things that have been held in other sports, like gaming sports, um, are huge. Um, and farming joining the fray is an interesting development. Um, the Czech agricultural machinery manufacturer Bednar FMT will be represented in the Farming Simulator League with its own team. The company, whose main focus is the production of soil tillage equipment, drill technology, fertilizer technology and mulching equipment, is currently looking for players to represent the company in the upcoming season. This was February. I'm not sure if they've got their full team yet or not. Players who are interested in playing for Bednar FMT can contact the company directly via Facebook message. We wish Bednar FMT the best of luck in Season 2. So Bednar, join the fray. Exciting times. Farming Simulator League starts at FarmCon 19. 
So, Giant Software, creator of the well-known Farming Simulator series. This was posted February the 12th. Um, and Class, one of the world's leading manufacturers of agricultural engineering equipment, are pleased to announce that Class will be hosting this year's FarmCon 19. Some of you may or may not already be aware of that. The game's largest farm sim community event at their headquarters in Harswinkel, Germany. Fans of Farming Simulator and Class, or Class, I'm never quite sure on that one, can also look forward to deeper collaborations between the two companies in the future. Important point. FarmCon 19 will take place on July 27th to 28th at Class headquarters in Harswinkel, Germany, uh, which will which will visitors which will give visitors an exciting opportunity to take part in factory tours and more. The event will also mark the beginning of the new Farming Simulator League, which is what we're talking about. A season of 10 esports tournaments with a total prize pool of 250,000 and at least 12,000 euros for each tournament alone. We're looking forward to welcoming the fans of Farming Simulator fans of Farming Simulator here at our headquarters in Hearts of Inkle this summer. Stephanie Victor uh, head of class merchandising says furthermore we are also excited about working together with giant software in the future just be patient she added we've got big plans and maybe a few surprises while i'm sure most of our enthusiastic players already know class farmcon 19 will be the perfect opportunity for them to take a look at the world famous machines in real life and visit the factory uh, where they're manufactured says Christian Armand, CEO of Giant Software. It's always great to meet players in person, and this time they'll be able to get a glimpse of what we're working on with one of their favourite brands. So we know Class are coming, we're not sure how or what form that's going to take, um, but also wrapped into FarmCon 19, that is the first official event of the new Farming Simulator League. So, the official schedule, schedule. February 25th, this was posted. Uh, the Farming Simulator League tours through Europe. The second season of Farming Simulator League will include a total of 14 tournaments. So now, as of February the 25th, that's been up from 10 to 14. It will be hosted in several European countries during these 14 tournaments. 250,000 will be distributed in prizes. The league will start at FarmCon at Hasselwinkel, Germany. Besides some online tournaments, which will also uh, we will also be guests at the biggest gaming events in Europe. Among them are Gamescom, Paris Games Week, the Zurich Games Show in Switzerland, and the PJ in Poland. A current list of all events can be found under this text. Well, the text that I've got up there, it doesn't show it, but it does say, as well as on our Farming Simulator League homepage. All new information will pop up on there. At the end of the season, the best 16 teams will finally meet at FarmCon 20, so a whole year away, where they will compete for the title of Farming Simulator Champion and €100,000 in prizes. Registration for new teams will be open in the next months, on the FSL homepage, we look forward to seeing you and your team at the tournaments. Now, that was February. I'm pretty sure that as of the end of this month, or it might have been last month, I'm sure the registration closed. Could be the end of this month. Um, this month being May. Depends when you watch this video. Okay, so. Krona, the power of green, joins the Farming Simulator League. This was April the 3rd. The second series of the Farming Simulator League is just around the corner. We're pleased to announce that Krona, a long-standing partner of the Farming Simulator series, is sending its own team into the competition. So a lot of these manufacturers are taking this quite seriously now, and I think they all want to vie and compete for you know being the champions. Um, Krona has been a well-known name in agriculture for over 100 years now, and the Power of Green wants to grab the title of Farming Simulator Champion. People are obviously well prepared over in Spe Speller, I think it's Speller. Um, as with uh, Frederick, could be Friedrich, Liefeling and Creative Mesh, they signed very experienced players of the Farming Simulator series for the league. Creative Mesh has worked closely with Krona in the past, releasing the well-received Stroberg's add-on. I'm not 100% sure what that is. That might be for Krona machinery, possibly. And this partnership will now be expanded as the team carries the Krona logo into the Farming Simulator League arenas. We are looking forward to further expanding the partnership and winning the title together with Krona, says Friedrich Liefling, very confident man, uh, captain of the newly founded Krona team. We welcome Krona to the Farming Simulator League and wish you the best of luck. So more people are joining the fray. As of April the 25th, 2019, Austrian tractor manufacturer Lindner joins the Farming Simulator League. 
The family business from Tyrol does not jump into the unknown here, as they already organised the Geo Track Super Cup for over 20 years, a spectacular race for the best tractor drivers in Europe. Now Lintner wants to prove itself on the virtual fields, uh, that they are among the best. The Lintner team will start uh, into the Farming Simulator League season 2019 to 2020 to compete for the title of Farming Simulator champion. We're looking forward to the exciting events and competitions all over Europe and we will bring a powerful team to the game, announces Head of Marketing and Export, David Lintner. Our goal is clear. We want to bring the strengths that distinguish our tractors to the league and get the trophy. Great ambitions and Lintner is looking for the best drivers of Farming Simulator League for it. We're looking for the best talent who can show off their skills with their nimble uh, with the nimble and versatile Lintrack in Farming Simulator explains David Lintner. We're excited which player champions we'll be able to add, we will be able to add to our Lintner team and carry our logo into Farming Simulator League. Applications are possible at marketing at lintner-tractoran.at. We wish Lintner all the best for the coming season and look forward to welcoming them to the league. So they're also looking for team members. Again, I'm not sure if that's closed now or not, because that was as of April, but potentially that's still open. Which brings me on to May the 15th, very, very recently. The official tournament rules are now available. The official tournament rules for Farming Simulator League are now available for download. Head over to the media part of the website. So if you go to the Farming Simulator League website, they've got their own separate one, to download and read them. These rules are obligatory for all participant, participating teams and players. By registering for our tournament, you agree to these rules. All rules have been set up in the spirit of fair play. If you have, have, you, if you have any questions about the rules or their implementation, please send an email to esports at giants-software.com. So, the rules are in place, it's picking up pace, everything's getting a little bit more exciting. Which brings me on to uh, Mr. CLP's announcement, Channel News. Are you ready? I have been approached by Giant Software. I had a nice conversation with Lars Malkarek. I hope that's right, Malkarek, not Malcharek. Sorry, Lars, have I got that wrong? Um, and I have been asked... If I would like to go along and be a caster for the Farming Simulator League. What that basically means is commentator, presenter. Um, I will be attending FarmCon 19 for the first one. I have said I can do all of them, all of the events, if they want me to. Depending how it goes with the first one, we'll see. Um, so I'm now kind of in partnership with Giants. Um, I'm going to be helping to present the Farming Simulator League, the foray into esports, um, and the tournaments as they progress. I'm personally blown away by the whole concept of it. I had a really nice long chat with Lars. Um, I first got a message asking if I would be interested, which I th initially thought was a joke. I thought it was a prank. I thought someone was winding me up. Um, but we messaged backwards and forwards, then we had a telephone conversation, explained the whole thing. Um, so there, yeah, that's where the, the the channel, I'm still going to continue doing my Let's Plays, I'm still going to continue doing my Guide 2s, um, I'm still going to continue doing all the things I normally do on my channel. Um, there are going to be the odd weekends here and there throughout the next year, where I'm going to be going there, and I'm going to be, it's going to be streamed live and all that kind of thing. Um, as far as I'm aware, Virtual Farmer is on board as well. Um, and I'm hoping, if possible, to do some vlogging as well. To try and do some vlogging like on the trips as I go. You know, that kind of thing. Um, but anyway, that's that's kind of that's the news. Exciting times. Um, a step into something new. A realm which I'm, you know, not hugely familiar with. I play the game... I've never played it competitively. I remember sitting watching the um, Farming Simulator Championship with the bale stacking, thinking, how could I possibly get three people together and to be able to go and do this? It would be absolutely amazing. So to now be kind of part of it, um, part of the tournaments, part of the presenting sort of team, 
I, I'm it's literally mind blown. I, it's an incredible honour and a privilege, and I feel incredibly lucky to have been asked. Um, so yeah, that's the news. That's what's going to be happening. Um, I will keep you posted as to any developments. What I'll probably do when I'm doing my let's plays and that kind of thing, any bits and bobs. I won't do another dedicated video probably, um, just to let you know what's happening what the details are any more information that i'm allowed to share and sort of come your way um i will um but yeah that's it that's where we're going um i hope you have found this useful and informative um i hope you're looking forward to it as much as i am you know i think it's going to be incredible i uh, it just you know something to really really look forward to um so anyway if you have enjoyed this uh found it useful and informative in some way shape or form give us a like if you don't subscribe yet please do if you want to leave a comment feel free and if you want to share this video then of course please be my guest whatever you should choose to do thanks for watching